Okay, everybody, here we are. It's Conger Live, and we're here for another of the Team Wars Battle Days for a Sad Panda Cub. We're just going to jump right into it, because I am once again on a little getaway weekend. I'm in uh, central Thailand. I was at the beach today, going to go snorkeling tomorrow morning, so... Um, Fiance is rolling around in the bed. Hopefully she knows to keep quiet. Uh, we're probably going to go get some Thai massages here in a minute and go get something to eat afterwards. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to rock and roll with this deck, see what we can do. Even my character looks like he's on an island getaway with the little pirate sleeves and whatnot. So we're going to start off with Pokehand, just Randy in the back. Oh, he does the same thing. So it looks like hopefully ours is a little further back and bring him on our side. We're gonna play Dr. Timmo. Let's go ahead and get the uh, Indian kid out there. We're gonna play Dr. Timmy to get some ranged assistance there. And we're gonna play General Disarray to sink in on his Dr. Timmy. Mm. And there is Santa Claus. And now that is someone I actually said we should go for Santa Claus instead of the coon. But uh, as you can see, we do have the coon, not Santa Claus. Uh, luckily, our Randy was able to survive longer, but not by much, because there goes... There goes ours. And there's another one. I said we should go for Buccaneer Bebe. Ooh, and the fireball takes us out. Those plastic crumpling nuts. Nuts are keeping the bag right now. And, uh, yeah. This is an interesting volley here. Um, guys in a similar ranking in the 6,000s. So I got him a little bit higher up. But um, you know that I'm going to get lost right here. So I'm gonna lose. Oh, nice. nice. The hamsters are, of course, supposed to support. The uh, coon didn't have him at the right time. He was basically out. Oh, that's a bummer. Fighter to get up in there. Hopefully, oh, once again, no way to target both of them being defensive. But that just gives us a chance to go ahead and fight it down. We actually won that volley, uh, giving us the lead there. Um, this is actually looking uh, good. So, you know, this ray, once again, going to finish off. This ray was definitely a good call to stop the opponent's team. It's our team, I guess. Wrecking shop, looking good, looking good. Oh, and there is Mysterion. Uh, Mysterion is expensive, so if you don't get him out early, like this guy didn't, it's not going to do a whole lot of work, which is like, also very really low in cost and being able to punt the caps. You didn't have to allocate any caps into any of I think that's why we went that route. Of course, there are a couple cards here that can uh, completely avoid it. So we're going to give some power to our team here. We're make him strong. You know, Kenny was able to get in and finish him off. 3 0 for the first one. That's nice. Didn't give up a phone. Got three phones, so that's 23 points in the bag. Let's hope the next two games can go just as smooth after last week's donut. If y'all been watching my channel every week, um, then that's how it is. Also, thank you to everyone who subscribed subscribed to my channel we broke 100 subscribers which i know isn't a lot but that was the minimum requirement to be a official content creator on, uh, tag for the discord in the official south park phone store discord so thank you for all helping me get that so i'm now able to put up my videos there um, which is already doing we have a couple subscribers so those of you who are new to the channel also thank you for watching the whole point of me doing this is mostly to help my guild also let other guilds out there see what other people are doing maybe learn from my mistakes um, that's the biggest thing I want us all to gain smarter I know I'm no pro I'm a free-to-play player and I just love South Park it's a great show I've been watching it since season one so I've uh, seen every single episode some more than once <laughs> So, uh, yeah, just love the show. I feel like this is a really good game. I was playing a similar game to this, a couple similar games to this, but this is the one that really held my attention. I played um, 
what is it? It's uh, the Supercell one, Clash Royale for a while. Yeah, that game wasn't that bad, but uh, just uh, I couldn't. The art was just okay, and the IP was its own. I was never the Clash, whatever the other Clash was. Uh, Clash of Clans, I never really got into that. And then I was playing the Star Wars one that was like this. I forgot what it was called, but they discontinued that game. And I do play the Star Wars and Galaxy of Heroes. I've wanted to play that for about a year. I've been playing this one since. Shortly after launching, like I said in other videos, I had to take a short break on this game as I was trying to get out. But missing the fun of South Park, I did come back to it. I'm glad I came back. Happy that I'm in the clan coalition I'm in. We do have space. So if anybody watching out there says, hey, I need a good, fun to play with a group of folks, because um, we know we're not at the top tier, but we are in Golden League, and we got a lot of uh, players that grind and play pretty hard. So uh, if you're looking for a new set of people who your clan and fell apart, or even if you're not quite all the way up there, we don't mind helping people move up as long as you are getting your caps for these team wars and participating. And that's, that's kind of what we're looking for. So, there you go. This is turning around on me. I did take that one phone out. So, let us see here. Let's tweak can. That looks like the right way to go. Unfortunately, that is. Bravo will help them slow it down. Oh, they got us. That's another. <coughs> we're just gonna wait for our energy to recharge. Hopefully, Tim can't make it in here. He's already been played to me. You know, we could have waited for a little bit extra. Ah, we got one Zap in there. Just enough. Now they have a level 6 Tupperware to mine. Level 5 Tupperware is gonna walk right through. Explosion from Kenny. I was hoping Kenny was going to be able to attack the Tupperware before. It's kind of sad. Put two in front of. What's the back? Oh, back to the hamsters, which is good. We're going to tie. And now we're trying to volley things back. We don't want. I asked past to go zoom in there. Hopefully, here we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just right. Oh, I'm slow. Oh, that was rough. rough. I think he's got got me here. Probably something I did wrong. Mm -hmm. Super far, not enough. It wouldn't have stopped the hamsters anyways. I was a little late on playing that general disarray. Should have been faster on that. Also, that kind of caused me not to be able to pull off. I was thinking about what I was going to do. Not being able to pull off the shield from the kite to protect Randy. And so I kind of fell apart there. Probably could have done a little bit better. At least we got one phone, so it wasn't a complete donut in that second round. Uh, we're one and one. Definitely want to get more wins. Sometimes, even though like last week I got a donut, sometimes I'm actually kind of grateful if I got stuff going on IRL. To just get the games over with, but obviously we want to get those wins. When it comes down to the wire, game five, that's when the videos are longer. Because uh, I show you every single second. I don't cut it, we just record it, and get my commentary as I'm playing, and then we go right through it. Toolshed's a good pick. I wonder what did we take? We didn't take Toolshed. So I remember that was something we talked about, and I was like, yeah, Toolshed like sounds like a good pick. I mean, I'm not going that way, so I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. 
get rid of that baby. Baby is nasty. Oh, and I just played the wrong. I thought I was playing Super Fart. And I played the. Super Fart, anyways. So, one's been Mysterion. This guy's level 3. That is kind of nasty. Them off. Nope. This guy's 8,000. Oh my goodness. So, not sure if we're going to be able to do much here. Oh, we just stopped him just in time. He's going to get close enough to flash. I'm going to wait for that energy to charge. Probably going to have to put him in front. I wanted to just grab Tupperware as a tank and then put Frankie down, but screwed up and then put poor Andy off the, uh, the board. It's ready to go after. Sharon too, that was a, if it was Sharon versus Wonder Tweet, that was another one I probably looked at my phone, guys. I don't really like Wonder Tweet and his ability, especially because there's not a whole lot that you can combo it with here, maybe a Lava. I'm not a huge fan of Lava either. Um, I think that's where Fireball would have been better. I mean, yeah, it's more expensive, um, but it's more clutch and actually being able to handle the situation. Because um, you can only end up throwing Fireball on the crowd in the anyways, where Try to click on that. Where lava is going to do the same thing. Fireball, you can throw anywhere on the field. Lava, you can put on your side, so you're kind of backpedaling already when you play it. And then it's just not going to do as much damage. You slow them down. You still don't feel like it's as effective as a fireball. Where a fireball can help you in an offensive maneuver, um, that, uh, the lava just can't can't do it. Um, which is why I really like Professor Chaos because he drops the lava in the offensive position. It's really nice. It's a very, very strategic card. Of course, there's sometimes you have to kind of be careful on how you play him. Make sure that the right person is the furthest away because that's who he goes for. Um, that's not too, too bad. Santa and Sharon. Looking nasty. Another 85k. So maybe we're only going to get the one win this week. We're about to find out. Fireball, excellent use of the fireball there. That's kind of what I was thinking. In terms of how things go. Disarray is not going to get in there. No. We're definitely going to get the lava here for these guys. And also going to super fart. See, because the cost of a super fart and the lava, even though it's recycling, that's a fireball. I would much rather throw in a fireball at that group. Sharon would have died. Instead, I just wasted my energy. You know, maybe someone says, like, oh, you should just play the coon. Well, like, coon's just gonna get chunked up if I have anything to support it with. So they went fireball and. And. Um, sure, they really put me in work. Nope, done. All right, well, there you have it, guys. We got 24 points. Uh, not bad, um, not great. Um, better than last week, 24 points better than last week. Um, but I do have faith in my clan. Um, we have a good mix of guys that uh, can do some good stuff. Uh, one thing I noticed is even though like our shard is 24, you know, 28, 28, all around the same amount of players in the clans, um, the people you're playing against aren't necessarily the guys in this, in this clan anybody else who also has the same deck uh, options, which maybe everybody in the game, I don't know. If you don't, let me know. Um, it's not really one of those things I pay attention to. So 
Uh, 24 points, first one to put up a score. Once again, give us a like, give us a subscribe, show your friends how much I suck, and uh, so you guys can point me out at me, but dude, can't believe you did that, whatever it is. The whole point, like I said, let's game smarter. I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.